Hello, welcome back to this session. But we also have what they call the number function. Number functions, they work with numbers. For instance, we have the ABS or absolute. ABS returns absolute values or positive values. It will convert any negative number into a positive number. For instance, we can decide to have a negative salary just for demonstration. We can have a negative salary. So that, that means all the salaries will be returned in a negative. Then we convert this negative salary into a positive salary. So anything that is negative here will be returned as a positive figure. So when you run this, you can see that a salary that has been a negative it is now returned as a positive. This was the negative salary. We expected it to be negative, but it has been returned as a positive. So if we have any negative figures in our database, we can decide to change them to positive using the ABS function. Next, we have another function called the round. What the round does, it rounds off digits, just like you hear its name, round. For instance, we may decide to have this rounded when we specify this this is the figure we want to round off from 245,761 and we need it to be rounded to two decimal figures when we do that you can see that it has been rounded from three figures to two figures so what the round does it just rounds off digits. Now, you may have realized that we have this from the dual table. The dual table is not a table we have looked at so far. But dual table is a table, a dummy table available to every Oracle user. Any user, you must have an access to this dual table. It's just a dummy table used in Oracle for just experimenting stuff like this. So sometimes we use it when we find that we don't have the right table to use or to get our results from. We can try it using a dual table. So with the round, you specify the parameter and then the number of decimal places we need. If we don't put the decimal places, the second parameter, this will be returned as a whole number. For instance, if I remove the two, you can see that the, dis the whole number has been returned. Next, we have the floor and the ceiling. What the floor does, it returns a whole number that is lower or equal than the specified number. For instance, I have these digits. I have 20, between 20 and 30, that is more numbers. I have 20.1, 20.2, 20.3 up to 20.9 this is just reflecting this is just showing those numbers that are between 20.3 20.4 20.5 up to 20.9 now before we reach 30 now what the flow does it will return a number that is lower or equal to the number specified for instance I need to get the flow of 20 a whole number that is lower or equal to 20.5 when we look at this the whole number is obviously 20 because 20 is the lower whole number to 20.5 when I look here this is it will go to 20 and if I'm looking for the seal What seal does, it will look at, actually this is 21, not 20, not 30. So what they, with the seal, when we set the seal, it will look for the next whole number that is above or equal to 20.5. So when I look at this, it has to be 21. 21 is actually the number, the next whole number that is above 
So when we come back to Oracle, if I need to get the flow or seal of 20.5, you can see that I have 20. And with a seal, it is 21, just like we have demonstrated so those are some of the number function there are many of them and we can't finish them but we just pick those functions that are mostly used let us look at the null handling functions